Hello Warfighters, war is hell. We've got some more Freeman Guerrilla Warfare coming your way here. Last episode, I finally graduated from having that pistol. Uh, and now I've got a rifle. Uh, we've got a small group over here. So this should actually be good. I do want to get yet another like test with this rifle just to see you know, how well I'm going to do with it. Because, I mean, I've got one data point. I've got one uh, engagement here. And... I did great with it. I mean, it definitely had more kills than with the pistol. Uh, but all around, you know, that's going to be great for me because I could go up against some tougher enemies. As my guys level up, I can do more to help contribute, obviously, uh, with a better weapon. And then also, with more kills, that means I can uh, level up a lot quicker, too. So all in all, I'm pretty excited with where this is going. We're just going to head straight south, as you can see. I'm going to have this volunteer squad uh, following me as they progress. Obviously, they get stronger, more accurate, too. And so these guys have, like, no armor at all. So they're going to stick with me here. I'll need them, though, because I'll probably... If, if, if I keep playing like I have been, which is, you know, like, flanking the enemy, getting up close with them, I do want to have some guys who've got my back. I'm pretty sure I saw somebody off over to the right, maybe? Out to the left, I don't see anything. Huh. Maybe I didn't see anything after all. Okay. We're moving up. I'm going to take a look up here. Because, like I said, this is where... You know, it was on the right that I thought I saw some movement here out in the open. And nothing. You know, Iron Sights 2 with this weapon is not that bad either. I mean, it's pretty spot on. Okay. Still nothing. This isn't that bad, though. I mean, either they're holed up, waiting for us to come to them. I can imagine that's the case here. Since they've got 14 guys, we outnumber them. Smart thing would be to hunker down and wait for us. Stick in those trees or something like that. All right, somebody see somebody. Oh, I'm taking some fire already. Oh, some guys down there. I think there was. Okay, I'm going to get down. Remember, I've got some guys who could follow me, but they're kind of a ways back. They're with the main body. So I am stuck here for a little bit, just all by myself. Movement over there? Yep. There's a couple guys. Ah, I got to lead them. All right, there's a kill. Oh, those guys are really close. I've got some dudes who are off to my left who are firing at me. I'm going to have to engage him. Ah, I got hit. You know, I'm going to get down. Yeah, I pushed up way too far. Oh, I think that was somebody with a grenade. Okay, can't stick my head out too far here. Luckily, even in this uh, position here, I'm still regenerating health. I'm at 99 right now. I was at 98. Somebody back there. I mean, I could stand up, get a better look at these guys, but then I might be open to be getting hit more. Oh, somebody took him down before I could. Okay, so maybe I am pretty safe up here now since I'm not taking any fire. I still hear people exchanging fire. fire. That area's clear. All right, here's the guys that are supposed to be sticking with me. I think. Where's that guy firing at? Oh, someone to the left of that tree. Now to the... Oh, he's back by those rocks. Wait for him. Okay, he's going to go on the other side of the tree. Ah, never mind. I'm not going to see him. Time to push up. If they're back there, though, by those rocks, that's where I got to try and get to. There's only five guys left. So I can imagine it's one squad or maybe, you know, what's left of two squads, maybe. Poke my head up here and see. Yep, there's a couple guys who are prone. That guy's down. I think that guy took a hit. There we go. We've got him, too. One more. Oh, there's another dude on the other side. 
of that tree. Ah, oh, someone else got him six. That, I think, is my record. At least so far. Some of you guys are like, ha, that's nothing. Um, I just can't wait till I can get some of these bigger weapons, like the LMG and stuff. See, that's a 50 cal belt that you've got in there. I'm just going to take everything here. Once I get to a town, I'm going to go ahead and sell uh, for sure that rifle. Because one of the things that I definitely want to get is some type of optic for this. Let's see, what do we got? I'm not going to be able to see this guy. I mean, it's five looters. You got four up there. Right, let's do it. Let's do another quick battle here. And then we'll, we'll end this episode. Maybe after this battle. I should have, I mean, I definitely should have enough to be able to get like an ACOG site or something. All right, we're going to go the same uh, way we did this before. Have three squads that uh, kind of be moving up together. And then the one squad of volunteers, that'll be a group that uh, I'll control. I'm going to space these guys out a little bit, though, because with how this is starting off, us in the enemy area, it's very possible we could have the enemy coming from any direction. So I do want to have these guys spaced out just in case they're, like, super close and the enemy tosses a grenade at us. I don't want taking out a whole bunch of us. All right. Time to move up slow. See, I'm already at... 117 here health so I'm pretty close to already being fully healed from that last engagement All right, I'm watching oh already taking some fire looks like they're off to the right yep now they're right in front of us the guy ducked just as I was opening up on him All right, those guys are moving behind a tree stump Oh, there was like, maybe that was uh, 40 Mike Mike from that mercenary rifle squad that I have. Or maybe it was the Grenadier team. That actually seems more legit. Okay. I'm just blindly firing up there. It's not doing me any good. So let me get into a better position. We're going to flank around to the left here. Hopefully the volunteers are going to be coming with me. Though, whenever I run, they don't run with me. Once I get up here, I should see where these guys are at. But they're probably prone. Yep, I figured that's what was going to happen. With them being prone, they're going to see me before I can spot them. So maybe this wasn't the best move that I had ever made. Okay. Head up here. Oh my gosh, I didn't realize they were that close. One dude at close range. Down. There's another guy. I hope he pops up here in just a second. Oh, it says I killed a thug. I wonder if it was the dude. Yeah, it probably was the dude that I just took out. Not this guy. Eight left. Looks like we've lost uh, one guy, one of the volunteers. Still worried about there being some guys up here. Yep. That guy again not go past the I'm having bad luck with these guys. Ah how did I miss him? Gosh, there we go. Is there another guy up there? I feel like there is at least one more, but we're down to four. Oh, they're behind us. See, that's what I was worried about. Okay, so these guys need to get back. I wonder if that's why my guys have, or uh, two of the volunteers now have been killed because they're being shot from behind. All my other guys, actually it looks like a lot of them are facing the direction and engaging the enemy behind them. A lot of open area between us and them, so I'm ah, with only two guys left. It's not worth flanking. Let's see if I can get some eyes on him. Yeah, there's a guy way off there in the distance. One shot. 
got that one down here with the bullet drop. I think I am ready to get some optics on this thing. We've lost another guy. So we've taken some casualties in this engagement. Uh, more than I was expecting. Granted, we're only at three. But that's some money. Oh. Nice. All right. Not four kills. I'll take it. Four out of 19, though. I could do better than that. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and leave this particular battle. Um, I'm going to take... The pistol, the rifle, and the money, obviously, that I've accumulated from these two battles that I'm going to head and purchase, hopefully, an ACOG site. I think that'll be ideal for me based off of the uh, type of engagements that I am doing here. Actually, you know what? We might have time to do one more. Let's go ahead and get these guys uh, refilled here. So I've got these squads fully manned. And then I've also got opportunities here to upgrade these guys. So, hmm. I think I'm going to go Mercenary Veteran Squad with these guys. It's the cheapest right now, but maybe an MG section would be nice too. Ah, I'm so torn right now. I love my MG. Ah, but also just better infantry might be needed as well. You know what? Let's go MG. I'm curious to see how this goes to see if these guys do provide me a substantial advantage you can see though that there's only three of them uh, so that's why I'm at 18 so I lose a couple guys by upgrading them but having that specialty might be kind of nice um, make sure I've got everything set before I go sweet okay so this mercenary militia squad I'm wondering if I still need them to follow me into this next battle because those are the guys who were the volunteers earlier. I upgraded them in case you didn't see it. Uh, let me look at. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, so since they're like upgraded now, I don't need to like follow them around. They should be good for open engagement. Here we are again in the red circle. Okay. So I'm going to try to position the MG team in the middle as my guys move forward just to. Uh, be that base of fire and then if I need my guys to flank or anything I could set them on the edges to do that Yeah, I'll have them follow me again because it I don't know it is Maybe I could have them go with the MG team But all right, let's do this guys All right time to move Towards the middle of this circle Let's go a little bit at a time though not push up too quickly there's the MG team off to the left there all right up oh, they're already opening up come on oh listen to that baby well there's a lot of them up there too okay this is the perfect place for us I'm not gonna be able to lie down really Got guys moving off to the left here on those rocks. We are mowing through them like nothing else. They are already down to five guys, four. Holy. I mean, yeah, I know I'm going up against looters who have zero armor themselves, but man. My guys are like ridiculously powerful now. Where's that coming from? Sounded like it was coming from the left. Oh, there's oh what do we got over here there they are trying to get some cover here yeah they're firing at me that guy's down there's some dude who went prone over there but I got another guy on the hill who's firing at me uh, that one went a little too high I think dropped him got one dude left and there he is Wow. All right. I will take that one. Wow. What a difference an MG makes. Now I really can't wait to get this thing. All right. Let's see. If I got anything. not oh, just a pistol and some cash. I'll, I'll take that. It wasn't even really that much cash, to be honest. That's a little bit extra to go towards 
the ACOG site. Who knows? Maybe I'll purchase some equipment too because I am going to need some armor. Uh, yeah, I kind of want to stay away from those guys. I, I don't think I'm at the point yet where I can go up against some of them. Wow. Now, they can't get upgraded past an MG section, which makes me kind of sad. Um, but while I'm here, let me go ahead and upgrade a couple things as well before we call it for this episode. I'll go up rifle expert again, intelligence. I still need that leadership and commanding to get some more squads. Uh, I've got one more skill. Let's go inventory so I can carry some more stuff here because I feel like I'm going to run low at some point. Um, going to go to Antipil to see what I can go ahead and purchase here. And then we'll go ahead and call it for this episode. So more Freeman Guerrilla warf uh, Warfare to come later on. Like I said in the previous episode, this is already updated uh, from these videos here. So I, I want to make sure I try to get caught up here as much as possible so you guys can see what this game is really like right now because when you've got day night cycle weather all that type of stuff it really does add a lot to uh the game here and i can't can't wait to show it off but first optics which is coming up next so thanks for watching i sure do appreciate it like the video if you enjoyed what you saw subscribe to the channel if you want to see more join the discord where you can talk about this game and really anything else that's on your mind and please consider donating to the patreon it goes to help me out quite a bit and support the work that I do. So thanks again, War Itself. You don't have to worry because Warfighters, I've got your six.